this is the best AI in Europe. <laughs> Don't smile. Everyone knows the AI tool called ChatGPT. Fewer people know about AI tools such as Gemini from Google, Claude from Anthropic, Perplexity or Grok. But I'm sure there are a few of you for sure. However, almost no one knows that Europe also has its own AI tool, which, according to all benchmarks, is not doing too badly compared to the American tools, into which billions of dollars are being poured. Let's take a look at it. And I will introduce you this European AI tool. This is Tomasz Czernowski from Tomas AI Channel. Our marketing agency has generated over 50 million US dollars in revenue for clients over the past 11 years. And AI now helps us achieve even better results for these clients in online marketing campaigns. My challenge for you is simple. Watch these videos for 120 days, take notes and test everything. By the end of 2025, you will use AI better than 99% of people and businesses. And that's my mission, guys. So let's dive into the Mistral. Mistral, or maybe it's the name. You can see that a lot of big companies uh, are using that Cisco, BMP, Paribas, uh, a lot of big companies, IBM, etc., etc. Le Mistral is from, uh, is headquartered uh, in Paris, 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 uh, in Paris. Uh, founded in 2023, it has open weight large language models, LLMs, with both open source and proprietary AI models. For as of 2025, the company has a valuation of more than 14 billion US dollars, which actually in the comparison with the other uh, tools, AI tools, the, the well-known, for example, OpenAI ChatGPT, ChatGPT is around 300 billion up to 500 billion via secondary share sale. So yeah, it's somewhere around that. So <laughs> much larger. Uh, Entropic is around uh, 61.5 valuation uh, in the Series E. Uh, 183 later race, uh, so uh, whatever, AI Grok, 114 billion, one report, targeting up to 170, 200 billion, Google Gemini, obviously, since it's, uh, you know, owned by Google, uh, there's a quite hard to, you know, establish the actual price and the value, so it's 150 to 700 billion. And then we have the Mistral, which is around, you know, 14 billion USD uh, around it. So, uh, so yeah, it's much, uh, uh, much smaller in terms of uh, valuation of money. But uh, we have an interesting article here comparing ChatGPT versus Mistral, and we will we will deep dive in it. So we actually see how it actually works, and also we will then deep dive in the tool, and I will I will show you the tool how it actually works, so you can so you can test it for yourself or for a company, and you can see the advantages or maybe uh, even some disadvantages in the comparison with GPT. So. The biggest difference here, uh, once we are in the in the uh, let chat, they call it let chat in the Mistral. Uh, the biggest difference is that uh, it's open and transparent approach. So let chat is developed by Mistral AI, a company committed to openness and transparency. Mistral regularly shares research model details and even open source models like Mistral 7B, allowing developers and researchers to build on on their own. Uh, many competitors, OpenAI, Google, and Tropic, keep their models and training data proprietary, limiting transparency and community collaboration. European focus and compliance. Lechet is built in Europe, obviously, in, uh, in France, adhering to strict EU regulations like GDPR. This makes it a strong choice for users and organizations prioritizing data privacy and compliance with European laws. So in contrast, most other major models, ChatGPT, Gemini, Grok, Cloud, are developed by US companies, which may handle data differently and are subject to US regulations, not European. So there are differences. And I think this, this one is a really big one for, for example, big corporations, uh, big companies, because if they need to you know, process data and use AI, for example, in Europe, it isn't as like easy in as uh, as you can do in in a small company or if you are your own boss your entrepreneur uh, that you just hey i will u just use ChatGPT or gemini or whatever i don't care right they can't do it so uh, it's a very important one for them uh, 
Also, uh, before we go into the next one, I would be really pleased and I would be really happy if you can provide me some support through uh, smashing the like button under this video. Uh, so this video will get to uh, more people uh, and this channel could be more seen because I'm really building one of the biggest AI channels in the world. So I know that it doesn't seem like it, you know, 150 subscribers. We are, we are in the beginning. So we are, you know, there's a long way ahead. There's a long way. It's a marathon, but I will be running that. So I would like to be invited. I would like to invite you basically on the road, on the run with me through the um, uh, smashing the like button and also clicking on the subscribe button and also clicking on the bell icon. Thanks. Thank you a lot. It would mean the world to me. Really appreciate it. Back to the video. So multilingual strengths. Mistral models are designed with strong multilingual capabilities, especially for European languages like French, German, Spanish, Italian, but also, for example, Czech uh, and Slovak, which, uh, you know, Czech, Czech language is my, uh, my native language since I am sitting in Czech Republic in Europe, in the heart of uh, Europe. So uh, that's why uh, this makes like chat particularly effective for non-English users. Contrast, while competitors are also support multiple languages, their performance can vary and English often remains the dominant language. That's, for example, uh, um, for example, in Claude from Anthropic, the Czech language is not that strong as, for example, here in the LeChat or, for example, uh, ChatGPT. So definitely, if you want to have some, you know, uh, let's say minority languages, uh, you know, translations or whatever, this might be a, a platform of choice for you. Customization and flexibility. Mistral offers customizable models and APIs, allowing businesses to fine tune like chat for specific use cases, industries, and workflows. Uh, contrast, customization options in other platforms are often more restricted or require enterprise level agreements, which is uh, for G GPTs or, for example, Claude. Focus on practicality and efficiency. LeChat is optimized for practical real-world applications, whether it's coding, data analysis, or creative tasks with a focus on efficiency and user-centric design. Some competitors prioritize flashy features. Grok's rebellious persona, Gemini's deep Google integration over pure utility. So you know the point, basically. Uh, you know, when, when you are in America, and I, I, don't, I don't have any problem with that, you just go big, you know. You, you want to have it big, you know. We are, you know, getting the biggest investment. We are building the biggest tool, you know. All the biggest things, you know, basically, that's what Americans do. And I, 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 don't, I don't have any problem with that, you know. I uh, support uh, one of the best American football teams, Philadelphia Eagles. I am a huge fan. I am a huge fan like maybe 13, 14 years and Jalen Hurts, you know, Sakon Barkley, uh, before that, Mike Lovick, uh, Donovan McNack. I know all of these and I support, you know, NFL, etc. So I am a huge on America, you know, the food, uh, the things that uh, when I was in New York City and Long Island, it was great. It was really support, uh, superb. So I, I'm really, you know, onto it, but uh, for example, if you can basically be uh, more, more, uh, let's say, effective and more practical uh, with the use of your money, I think it's an advantage. And I think that, uh, for example, some European companies have that in their DNA and it can really benefit them over the US tools. Community and developer support. Support Mistral actively engages with developer community, offering tools, documentation, and support for building applications on top of their models. Ethical, which is uh, for some people or uh, for some companies, really, uh, really uh, important one. Mistral emphasizes ethical AI development, including bias mitigation, fairness, and responsible use. This aligns with European values and global best practices. Ethical considerations very vary. Uh, across competitors with some facing criticism for bias, misinformation, or lack of transparency. So, uh, when to choose LeChat? You prioritize data privacy and GDPR compliance. You need strong multilingual support, especially for European languages. You value transparency, openness, and community collaboration. You want a customizable, efficient AI for special practical tasks. So, once you create a new chat, you basically have here the first button. Uh, so, on the left side, it you know basically it forces me, it motivates me to uh, upgrade to Pro, uh, but uh, I don't have the Pro. But if you would like uh, me to try the pro in the comparison of, for example, paid uh, GPT, paid Gemini, paid other tools like, uh, like for example, Perplexity, uh, then definitely uh, comment under this video pro, 
PRO, PRO, and I will do that for you. So if there will be uh, some comments around that, I will do that for you. So we have the comparison, the pro versus pro, right? Not the free versus pro. So uh, uh, on the left hand side, you can see uh, in the, in your chat on the left hand side, you can see the icon of Mistral, and it's ba these are basically your agents. So you can create a new one, or you can pick the one the ones that are there, which is data analyst, for example, convert any CSV file into an analysis, global summarizer, summarize documents of any type, uh, personal tutor, com experience personalized learning with you, writing assistant, elevate your writing with the personal writing. You can have uh, files attached, and you can also create a library. You can use uh, with this infinite uh, infinite icon. Uh, you can have deep research, which is actually 10 times the speed. And I have five uh, researches left for this month uh, since I'm on a free uh, on a free account. Think uh, regime more thoughtful answers with transparent reasoning. Awesome. And under the tools, you can see code interpreter, um, image generation, canvas, uh, very similar to uh, what we know from ChatGPT, web search. Uh, and you can also here have some connectors, Gmail, Google Calendar, Outlook, Atlassian, Box, GitHub, Linear, Notion, Stripe, for example. Uh, these are beta, so this is a new thing. <coughs> yeah, obviously that's correct. Uh, uh, bless me. And voice mode, you can have voice mode. Under in the top uh, right hand side, you have incognito mode. So you can basically turn on incognito. Chatting with uh, the mode are temporary and private. No memories are stored or used. So this is basically it. This is uh, the La Mistral, La Chat, uh, the uh, European AI tool that actually can compete with other tools. Uh, it has some advantages and obviously some disadvantages, but I would be definitely, uh, I would definitely. Uh, encourage you to you know give it a go uh, give it few prompts and test it uh, and i think that this can really can uh, benefit you if you are some company in a europe or if you want to be in a europe and you want to do some european stuff with the gdprs and all of that you know bureaucracy etc cetera, etc cetera. i don't like it but you know that's where we live in so i need to understand it and i need to uh, go by it but uh, definitely, definitely a tool that I would uh, consider one of the biggest 10, let's say, uh, that can actually change something in the future. Uh, and it can actually be used in enterprise, uh, you know, level of companies. And also it can be used in a smaller ones. But hey, obviously, uh, it depends on the use case. So definitely check this out. Uh, definitely support this channel. I would, uh, it would mean the world to me. And I would highly appreciate it if you can like the button, uh, like the channel, <laughs> click on the like button, sorry. Uh, uh, subscribe uh, this channel and also click on the bell icon. It would definitely mean the world to me. R literally building the best uh one of the best AI channels out there on the YouTube. So it's a long way. I know, I know it's an ambitious, I know that too. Yeah, I know that, but I'm really building that. So I would you, I would invite you, uh, or I am inviting you to be on this, uh, on board with me on this, on this uh, path or a road or a mission to uh, one of the biggest AI channels out there. So thank you very much. Uh, don't forget to click on this video. It's a really good one, a really interesting one. So give it a go. And I will see you guys tomorrow with the next one. Cheers.